What's up guys, Spin Firearms here. Anyways, so I made a video a while ago about how to carry while in your vehicle. Um, this is how I do it. I took everything behind my firearm so I have easy access to it and it's secure. A lot of people in the comments said, oh, keep it on your lap, stuff like that. They keep it on their lap while driving around, whatever. That honestly looks really bad. It honestly looks like you're trying to actively use it, um, in my opinion. I could be wrong, but you know that's what I think. If you get pulled over by a cop and you're trying to take it and move it to your passenger side seat or something like that, even if it's just sitting it out, sitting out like that, it looks bad. Plus, the cops gonna see you reaching and you know all that stuff. When you have it secured in a holster, um, on top of what I just said, if you come to a complete stop, like I used to live in Detroit back in the day, someone would pull in front of you. You, it would be immediately, you know, they're going to jump out and come after you. They're going to rob you, take your car, whatever. If someone's pulls right out right in front of you, you have access to it. Whereas if someone pulls out right in front of you and it's on your lap and you slam on the brakes, your firearm is going to go right to your feet. Um, you're going to have to reach to get it, whatever. Because in Detroit, you know, you don't run, I mean, you don't stop at red lights. And also if someone's brake breaking right in front of you or driving too close um, or like going super slow in front of you, you know, that's most likely a robbery attempt. Um, that, that's just how it is there. Everyone knows that. So you want your firearm secured. This is the easiest way to do it. It's out. You're not scaring little kids or anything because nobody's looking into your car or can see into your car. Plus, it's easy access to it. It's not going to go flying if you have to stop on the brakes because of an emergency or you have to defend yourself. And on top of that, police are going to see that it's holstered. And so it's a real quick, um, okay, I have a gun on me, blah, blah, blah. Okay, you're good to go. I saw your license. You're fine. That's the best way to carry in the car. Don't make the mistake of driving with it on your lap. Even though there's drop safeties and stuff like that, I don't think the fire would go off even if you slam on the brakes and stuff. It's more about your own safety and your own ability to get to it if you needed to. But yeah, that's just my take on it. Thanks for watching.